good garden tools. And this, our customers say, is without a doubt one of their favorites, but it has received an upgrade, and we're gonna talk about that. This is the Spearhead Garden Shovel and Spade. It now has a reinforced handle. We have more colors than we've ever offered before. We have a pattern that we've never offered before, but we still have it at that great price of $46 and change, and we have it for you on three payments of easy pay. Julian Matthew is here. Hi, Julian, nice Hi. to see you. Good Always see you, a Jill. pleasure. Thank you. Um, one of my favorite garden items, Julian. I found this item before I had ever presented it on air. I had never seen it presented on air. I found it on QVC.com and saw that it was customer top rated, and I thought, for a shovel? But I gave it a try. I love mine so much, I let my mom borrow it. She wanted one for Christmas. She now has one of her own. We ended up buying a second one because my husband wanted one when he was working and I wanted one when I was working. It's just one of those items that you don't know what you're missing until you get this at home. Like you don't know what you don't know at this point when it comes to garden shovels, but when you get this at home, you're gonna think she was so right. It's the best garden tool I've ever bought. How is it different? Well. It has to do with this special shape that you can see, right? This is uh, a regular shovel, regular round point shovel that everybody has in their yard. Yeah. And this is the spearhead shovel right yeah. here. And you can tell it looks like a spear, right? It's pointed like a spear. It's, it's got these special angles here. And also it's sharpened like a spear. Every angle here is sharpened from tip to tail. So all these surfaces that are going into the ground yeah. are sharpened and angled into the ground versus across the ground. Right. So now if you hit some roots, which we'll show you a demonstration with roots with a regular shovel and then with this, now those roots are being spread apart and being sliced individually as they uh, go up. Great. In case of rocks, it just bounces one, off one rock to the other, pushes the rocks away like a wedge splits wood. Yep. And when it comes to clay, it just slices and dices. Yep, it's great. Let me go through our colors because yes. we have some that are brand new. Um, and then I want you to talk a little bit too about the improvements that you've yes. made because you've upgraded it, which is which is fantastic. So as you look here, I have to let you know, you and I worked together last season, Julian, when we debuted some of the colors and yes. we sold out of some of those colors really early quickly. in the season. So I need to let you know, if you want some of these colors, I wouldn't wait. Here is your lavender. Here is your pink. Here is your green, we call it lime. Here is the original spearhead yellow. Now brand new, making their debut right this second. Here is your floral, which is pink with kind of a little cherry blossom pattern. And also brand new, making its debut right now, is the teal. So take advantage of your opportunity to get this. You've reinforced the handle, why? Yes, yes. because you know, the first thing that goes on a shovel is you're gonna break a handle. Mm -hmm. We don't want you breaking handles. We used to have a northern ash hardwood in here, yeah. and, and that was pretty good, uh, as you know from our customer reviews, yes. right? Um, but we wanted to make it even better, because anytime you're dealing with natural materials, the natural material can have some variations. Sure. We didn't want variation. We want a super strong shovel, so we may put a metal tube inside here instead of the uh, hardwood. Okay. And so, in addition to having a uh, longer socket, than normal shovels, which protects it in the areas most prone to be broken and double riveted. Inside here is a uh, steel tube and reinforced fiberglass. This is a special kind of fiberglass designed to bend without breaking. It's used by pole vaulters. It's designed uh, to bend without breaking. Interesting. And in, so very tough handle. And here we have a, long, a larger grip than normal. Uh, we started this last year. Yeah. And it allows you to use a gloved hand or if you have big hands like myself, yeah. to, to use this shovel uh, very comfortably. In addition to that, we have the larger footrests here. Now those larger footrests come in handy when you're digging and you don't quite have the right shoes. Yeah. You might have sandals or slippers and you're out there digging right. anyways. Yes. Well, you can do it with this because it makes your job so much easier. I've even read reviews from folks who said I was in my flip-flops doing my gardening and I could do it in my flip-flops because of those little um, platforms, if you will, um, with the spearhead. Yep. Show us how it yeah. works, let's what makes it so different. Let's show the proof of the pudding here. Okay. So we're gonna take a regular shovel. I weigh, unfortunately, 220 pounds now. Okay. I need to lose some weight. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna put my full weight on this, right? I'm gonna stand up, full weight, 220 pounds. Here, a little bit zoomed, out. there you go, see? Now, nothing's happening. Okay. That's like when you're out there jumping up and down and nothing's yes, happening. Yes, right. Well, now I'm barely gonna to tap this. Barely gonna to tap it. Watch. So we'll do it again. So, as a matter of fact, I'm going to do it with just my hands. So you can see that it goes through these strings, which are simulated roots. Roots, yes. Like I said, they're subdividing the roots, 
and then slicing them individually as they go in. So it's a very tough blade. Matter of fact, the blade is so hard, you cannot sharpen it with a file. You have to use a grinding wheel or diamond stone. Okay. It rings. That's because it's so hard. Wow. In addition to that, like we said, the handles reinforce, the grip is larger. But the proof of the pudding is when it digs when the hard soil conditions. Yes, right. Clay soil, rocky soil, um, lots of roots. Or just things that are hard to cut through. So maybe you want to divide your grasses or you want to divide those hosta plants or those day lilies we had earlier. After they're three, four, five years mature and they're huge, you want to divide those up. Like how do you cut through that established root system? You do it because you have the spearhead. The I use this not, I mean, for these jobs, but for me, just even digging some holes in my backyard to put in new plants. It takes less time. It takes takes less effort. Listen, I have a replaced knee. I have a bad back. <laughs> right now I have some shoulder issues. Like I'm falling apart, but I can still do everything I need to do because I have a tool that's so strong. I don't need to use much strength to do it. The shovel's doing it for me. It's magnifying all your digging forces because all your energy is going into one point at yeah. the very tip. Right. And then it's multiplying your digging effort. Just like you said, you have ailments. My dad, 85 year old dad, when he invented this, he came up with this concept. He has two artificial knees, two artificial hips. Yeah. 85 years old, 93 now. There's your dad. Now. <laughs> He says, you know, I either have to give up my passion or I have to come up with a better way. Yeah. This is the better way. The better way. way. So any, anybody that's around that doesn't have the help anymore that they used to have around and they were waiting for somebody to help them, you no longer have to wait. This is your new buddy for the garden. This tool will allow you to do what you thought was impossible to do and you had given up on doing. Right. No longer the case. Um, when you made the improvements, did it change any things in terms of how it handles, the weight of it, how heavy it's going to be? It's within three ounces of okay, what the other great. shovel. So awesome. we made it stronger but not heavier. Love it. Very strong. That's important, I think, for a lot of you. 600 of you have just dialed in. Let me review the colors again. We sold out of them early in the season last year and you're a lot of you were out of luck so the good thing about your home with Jill is that we're one of the first garden shows of the season and you're getting first dibs on colors so take advantage of your chance to get the lavender which is right down here here is the pink here's that lime green there's your original yellow brand new making its debut here is your pink floral and it's like a cherry blossom print. And then finally down here, I might need to get this one too. I kind of like this teal, teal color. Yep. <laughs> there is your teal. If you already have one, it is not a waste of money to buy a second. Because let me tell you, if there are two of you, or sometimes you like to enlist the help of your grandkids, or it's you and your husband and you do different jobs around the garden, you each want your own. Here is a great example of how it can get in rocky soil. Yep, and I'm gonna show you how these angles uh, allow you to go in between the rocks. Yeah. I'm gonna do it in super slow motion so you can really see what's happening. See that, how it just glances it glances, it glances, it wants to go in between the rocks. Yes. I'm not aiming now. It right. doesn't matter what angle I go. See how it goes in between the rocks? Love that. It, it finds its path of least resistance. Yes. It, it subdivides, it spreads, it wedges. Just like a wedge splits wood, this yes. splits the ground, cuts it's, the ground. If you have never tried one, here's another thing that's important about QVC. We have our 30 day return policy. If you get this at home and you don't think that it is worth the money you spent or you don't use it the way you thought, or it's not what you expected, you can always send it back. But let me tell you, that first day you are out managing how you're going to do your garden. That first day you decide, I am so sick of that huge hosta by my front door, I want to get rid of it. That first day you decide you're going to dig up that big tiger grass and put something else out in your backyard, you will be thanking us for bringing you this spearhead shovel. It is the best investment for your garden you could ever make. You know you have something good when the master gardeners of the world and the landscapers of the world are looking for this and they're buying it by the caseful because it makes their job so much easier wow. and more effective and they're, they're paid by the dollar so they need to be effective and efficient. Yep. They're using this tool to make their job much more quickly done. Remember, close to a thousand of these now requested, brand new in the teal and the floral, and then of course the yellow, the lime, the pink, and the lavender back in stock. Thanks so much, Julian. Thank nice you. to see you. Um, listen, we're busy on the phone, so do stay on the line if you're dialing in. If you are somebody who is looking to make some improvements in you,